shit, I forgot to do my, uh, my thing again. I forgot to switch back to my fucking, uh, my thing, my, my transition. I turn it off sometimes when I have to switch between scenes to set things up. And, uh, I sometimes forget to put it back. Anyway, hello. Hi. How is it going? How is everybody doing today? Hello, Captain. Yeah, uh, it's a pain, so I just switch it to cut, because I need to, uh, look at some stuff, and then I forget to change it back. Because I'm dumb. It happens. We have a couple new redeems. We have a couple, uh, fun new redeems, if you want to check them out. I maybe got a couple things set up for reasons. Oh, Captain, you're so sweet. I had a lot of fun working on that one. I really got to play with some fun stuff. I got to learn some things doing that one. Where's my jams? Where's my tunes? Here we go. Coyote, welcome. Oh. Who hit me? Who just hit me? What'd you just hit me with? Oh, I shouldn't have called it bonk. Do I have two different bonk redeems now? Did I fuck that up? Oh, oh. Do I have two different bonk redeems now? Should I change that? I do I have two different bonks. Well, let me give me a, give me a hot second. Let me fix that. Let me fix that quick. Uh, it's actually not tits. It's a K bonk, cause I had an easier time setting that up. I had an easier time setting up K bonk than than tits. Uh, they do the same thing, so it's it's all the same in the end. Uh, I think just a tits you can use a 3D model and K bonk you can't. Uh, where's the other bonk? Oh damn! Okay, the other bonk is the expensive one. Let me uh, change this. There we go. Okay. Now it is renamed. You can you can probably refresh and it'll be fine. Uh, so we're working on this more today. We're gonna, I'm gonna finish up the expressions. Oh, who threw that? Who threw that? Captain, I see you. I see you throwing things. But yeah, we have throwing redeems now. There's three, there's two, there's two of them, and I've added throwing to hydrate. Because hydrate has to be the funniest redeem, I don't know why. It gets a sound, it gets, it gets throwing. Put my tea over there. Grab my tablet from over here. Okay, so right now we're gonna be working on the waving expression. Oh no, I sound like I'm on old timey radio. Oh, oh my goodness. Uh, let me turn the those off so that I can kind of see what I'm doing. How are we today? How is it going? It's the middle of the week. We vibing, we getting through. I hope you're all doing good. I hope you're all doing good. I'm doing good. I'm doing quite well, honestly. Surviving is good. That's, uh, frankly the most we can hope for in these times. No, don't overwork yourself. Don't do that. Take breaks. Take care of yourself. I demand it. I demand that you, you take breaks, take care of yourself, be good to yourself. Good.
Oh, there's screamy birds outside. Screamy birds. Birds are screaming. Uh, so how about all that, uh, all them, all them Pokemons? We're, uh, Captain, are we doing Friday? I also wanted to ask you what time. Did you want to do, uh, three for me again, or one? So, there we go. Um, whatever time you, is, is better for you is fine. But I, uh, I need to know. And, uh, and then on Sunday we're gonna finish Arceus. I swear. I swear we're gonna finish it. Uh, okay. Wave. Arm. Line. Get right on in there. Oop, that's too thick. That's too thick. But I want to get through this. I want to finish this for Choo Choo. Uh, and then I will be looking for another one to do this month for March. Uh, that would be super helpful. Wave on flat. Pop that down there. So if anyone is looking for a chibi model, uh, or or a full half body, full body, standard proportion live two D model, uh, hit me up. I'm still working on uh, somewhat reduced prices. To get myself established. Hey, Dr. Raymond, how you doing? It's been a hot, it's been a hot minute. How's it going? How are you? But yeah, so if you're looking for a model, or you know anyone looking for a model, uh, I can do that pretty cheap at the moment. Good, good. Glad to hear it. Wave arm. And then we'll do one above that for wave hand. I am doing pretty good. I am getting by, making my way in the world today. Give everything you got. Um, making this live 2D model. Trying to, uh, you know, get enough commissions to get by. So I'm, uh, you know, I'm looking for clients for March. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Can I just turn off the head for a second? Uh, hair back is what I need to turn off, yes. Hat bottom. Oh, 
Nope, that is... That is the head. There we go. Sometimes you just gotta turn things off so you can see what the fuck you're doing. I'm thinking about adding some new supporter rewards in the Discord soon. I've been talking to Maru about that. I've been talking to Maru today about some... Some things. Oh! Oh, is it Ulu time? It's Ulu time. Uh, so yeah, I'm thinking about some, uh... Some supporter rewards. Such as, uh, custom, custom voice clips. And request voice clips. Uh, I'm thinking about doing some wallpapers. Some desktop wallpapers. If there's anything else you'd like to see, especially if you are a supporter, uh, please do, please do tell me. Yeah, you get you can get a personalized Ana Ana. You can get one just for you. You can tell me what you want me to say, and I will say it in whatever kind of voice you would like, whatever tone. If you want the uh the uh the, the dummy mommy experience, I'll give you that. I don't give a shit. Um I will also, you know, if you're if you're not a recurring supporter, I will also, you can also just uh, hit me up, and I will I will say whatever you want for money. I don't I don't give a shit. Oh my god, I forgot that was on. Uh, I will do stuff with voice changers. I will say things with voice changers if you want. And you, you can just you can just do whatever you want with those. You'll get a a, a video and an MP3. I've been watching the Sonic 06 fan dub again. I I cannot tell you how often I watch that. It's funny every fucking time. set too high right now because I was working on uh, slightly larger files yesterday and needed it to be set a little higher. I needed it set on like five instead of three. <laughs> you should have access to the clips channel on Discord. Can you put it in there too? I think I th think everyone has posting access in there. Yes! Nice. Nice. Uh, so let's see. Wave. Sleeve. And then my pen.
we go. But yeah, yeah, how, how is it going? Um, so what do you, what y'all, what y'all, so I'm, you know, I'm thinking, thinking about those rewards and stuff. Uh, if that is something y'all would be interested in. If you, if you're a sub, you should join the Discord, uh, cause there are, uh, subscriber and patron only Discord channels. That no one uses. No one uses those, and I would love to, uh, see those get used. But, uh, yeah, you can, you can request, you can request one voice line every month. I need to check what my support tiers are. Cuz I think if it's like the a Twitch a Twitch sub or uh like a a 5 or 10 dollar Patreon sub, I don't know what my tiers are. Then like you can you can request voice lines. I do want to start, like, recording, do, doing pre-recorded YouTube stuff, too. I'm just so bad at, like, coming up with that. Hey, Choo Choo! Choo Choo, you take care. You, you work hard. You get done what you need to get done. I'm so excited to, to show you this one is done. big actually what we can do is we can turn off these sketch layers turn off torso hips and legs there we go go back up here turn off arm do this select Expand six uh, raise that a little. Ten should probably be good. Uh, let's do it a little more. There we go. There we go. That's what we're looking for. That way just the shadow on the inside can move a little bit when we shade that. And then we'll do wave, sleeve, flat, turn this off, come back over here. Get some of those. Oops. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. And then just grab that. Grab these pixels. Uh, 
turn the arm back on. Turn this back on. Uh, can I finagle this a little bit? There we go, that's like where I want it. And then what I need to do is turn the jacket on, turn the jacket bottom, bottom, this should be several pieces. There we go. And then make a piece that goes kind of over this for if there's a wave with that on. New folder, wave jacket. And then this can go in here. We'll turn wave sleeve down. We'll turn wave arm down. a little further there we go there we go that's kind of because I want that to cover this whole thing Okay, so that's going to be a separate piece that's going to have to go under sleeve. So, sleeve jacket. Right. Did I not put my tunes on? I didn't put my tunes on. Get some, get some sick jams. I'm like, why is it so friggin' quiet? Back with the, uh, the Rider Sentai Mega Jams playlist. Oh God, I gotta, uh, I gotta watch the end of, uh, Zenkaidra. Uh, I don't know. I think it was just, I think it was just like that.
Zoo Ranger, Zoo Ranger was just like that. We, there are things about Zoo Ranger that I will never understand. There's an episode of Zoo Ranger where, like, fucking aliens show up in a VW bug. It's a weird fucking show. Zoo Ranger is fucking buck wild. Yeah. Like, there, there are so many things about Zoo Ranger that I just... are just beyond me as a person. All my cats here. I was, I was brushing him before. You would not believe the amount of fur that comes off this fucking cat. Yeah, you've got so much fur. You've got so much fur, baby. Come here, go sit in the window. Go sit in the window. I do not know the words to this song. What? This man is out here yelling at me. Just straight up, just straight up yelling at me. Like, I honestly, in the time that I was watching Zoo Ranger, I barely remember the opening. Oh god, nine. Why is that on nine? Sometimes my area scaling gets set, like, super high. Um, okay, so then above this one... Right, and then wave jacket left. Uh... <laughs> it's actually, it's not that different from the Die Ranger opening. I mean, this opening does fucking slap. It is so fucking good, but I don't think it's actually that different from the Zoo Ranger opening. Die Ranger. Wave jacket left line. And then once we have this, 
we will have the full sleeve assembly. And then we'll bring the arm back up. And there, that way it will it will all connect. And these uh, they can be turned on and off relative to uh, what's going on. Diving Just, uh, I don't know why it does that. There we go. Uh, and then we will also do it on the left side. Oh. Uh, turn those off for just a moment so that we can correct that edge. Uh, let me turn the jacket off. Uh, I need the texture that I made. There we go. You hold on, hold on to the textures that you make, kids. I got another bag of pineapple gummy bears. They're fucking, they're just selling pineapple gummy bears right now. That's crazy. Sorry, I see a uh, my chippy template. Yeah, it's just, it is a bag of only pineapple gummy bears. Because, I don't know, someone knew that I liked those. They're just at my supermarket. I can just get them. I now need to resize this a little bit. Okay, that seems right. Yes, uh, pull that in here. Oh, not jacket. Um, I want it in, not arm, I want it in sleeve. And then I want to turn jacket off. And then
and then we mesh transform kind of want to crush these down. how good at this we are. Uh, I'm going to do that. And then we just want to do a little bit of liquefying. Just to, just to push just to push stuff in such a way that it it looks kind of like the fabric is has kind of folded over itself That one tea leaf. Ah, yes, I can read. Amazing. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing? I hope you're having a good, a good Wednesday. Oop, push that back just a little bit. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. It's amazing. Tea leaf or tea leaf? Okay, I'm probably gonna call you leaf. Uh, probably just gonna call you leaf, since that's okay. I'm doing good. I'm working hard, getting shit done. Uh, we can merge that onto the sleeve layer. Turn the, ooh. Hold on, let's go fix that. Cause there's a whole uh, section of, of shit missing there. I am Sonomi Khan. I am a former Super Sentai villain uh, who has changed my ways. And I just vibe and stream and do art in between helping my Sentai team. Uh, let's just get the jacket back on just to take a look at that. I do need to get that gold stripe on there. Uh, but let's just color the hand, the arm and hand quickly. So we can, uh, just to clean that up. It's drinking the water! Oh, oh dear. I 
Hydrate is my favorite redeem. Anytime I add functionality to this, the only thing I haven't added on to Hydrate is a voice mod. <laughs> I told you. I told you that I added, I told you I added it to Hydrate. Uh, the only thing that Hydrate doesn't, doesn't do is change my voice. Uh, though if I could find an underwater voice, is there like an underwater voice in voice mod? If there is an underwater kind of voice, I would add that to hydrate. Oh no, no, that's okay. Leaf, it's, it's there cause it's funny. It's there cause it's funny. I want that to happen. That's why I set it up that way. It's, don't feel bad. Please. <laughs> Coyote. Who threw that? Who threw that? <laughs> Leaf, it's fun. No, don't don't be sad. It's it's that way on purpose. If I didn't want it to throw things at me, I wouldn't have turned that on. <laughs> A little bit of bullying is okay as a treat because I know you all love me. Just because I know you all love me very much. Uh, okay. Okay, this time it is time for my little. I'm a little robot. I'm a little. I'm a little. I'm just a little guy. I'm just a little guy. Um, Turning all of all of my layers back on that I turned off. Cause I now need to see what I'm doing. Okay, looks looks good. Looks good. I just gotta get that, that little yellow stripe on there. And I need to do that before I forget to. Because I will forget to. I will absolutely 100 percent forget to do that. And then I'll be mad about it. Because this is for Choo Choo, and Choo Choo is fucking cute, and I, I love, God, I just, I love the other Tokutubers so much. I love them. So, thank you, here, we pull out so you can see the whole thing. There's a whole, this is for online Choo Choo, who is an android hamster, uh, who is also, who also assists their Sentai team. Uh, fellow fellow Toku tuber, fellow fellow Sentai tuber. Uh, if, I, if it ever looks like I'm putting something like very far over to the left, it's because my phone is in front of it, and I can't fucking see. Uh, let me just turn the arm off. If it, ever, if it ever looks like I move the canvas for a weird reason, it's so that my phone is not blocking the part of the screen that I need to be working on. Okay, you have a good you have a good walk. I like taking my cat out for walks, but it's been too cold. Uh, so you just you you go take your dog out. That's delightful. God, alive a life is such a good song. What a song. Sung by fucking Ash Ketchum. Ash Ketchum sings this song. Do y'all know that? Uh, we go to all layers. There we go. Ash Ketchum sings the opening to Kamen Rider Ryuki. Check 
Mike left. Line. Yeah. Uh, Rika Matsumoto. Both voices Ash and uh, sings the opening to Kamen Rider Ryuki. And those are facts that we all have to live with. Tension does it. Kamen Rider, Henshin Daze. That's the that's the pun. That's the pun right there. There we go. Sometimes, like, sometimes I listen to it and I'm like, man, I can't believe that. And then I'll listen to, like, certain lines and I'll be like, that sounds like it could be Ash. That's the, uh, that's the wonders of voice acting, baby. Okay, there we go. There we go. Uh, waving components complete. So wave is done, sad is done, angry is done. I think love is the one I didn't finish. <laughs> Did y'all know my birthday's in a week? My birthday's in a freaking week. Like, that's wild. Time is so incredibly fake. And then I will just need to separate these onto separate layers. Like, I can't believe it's already March, to be honest. Right line. I wanted to do like a big birthday collab, and I just didn't have time to figure out what I would do for that. So we're probably we're gonna play Mario Kart. We're gonna play Qu Quiplash. Um, maybe we'll play Among Us. We'll we'll do we'll do some viewer games with viewers. Uh, we might do a Q&A. Maybe we'll do a little birthday Q&A. So I wanted a little tea there. Uh, 
There we go. That's okay. That's okay. It may not be a long stream, honestly. Uh... God, Auburn Ranger has such a good opening. There we go. We got all of our expressions. All of our expressions uh taken care of. So let's save. Okay, so someone use the save your work redeem. This is a special redeem for art streams to remind me to save my fucking work. <laughs> I love it. Bully me, bully me into saving my work. Bully me and oh, oh, okay, coyote. Okay, hold on. Let me get let me get in real close for you. Ada ada. Ada ada. Coyote sun. There we go. <laughs> That's so wild. That's such a thing to be doing. It's because because I love you. It's because I love you all so much. Okay. Uh, boop. We don't need to be in that far, I think. Look at this. Look how freaking cute. Actually, I want to, before I start shading, I do need to be here. I want to uh, recolor all the line art. Again, not the most exciting part of the process, but... Uh, there we go. Transparency lock. That's maybe too light. There we go. That's better. That's more. That's more what I want. Do I have a palette layer somewhere? Just stick it up here. Uh, ears. I just like the look of colored line art. I just think it looks so dang good. Like it, it just looks better. It looks better for the the art style that I do. Uh, sometimes, not always. Sometimes it looks better if I don't color it. But if it looks better, I always at least try to. And then if it looks better as a solid color instead of a. Uh, like this, then, then I will, uh, just leave it a solid color, but, uh, I always try to, and I think for, for live 2D models, it always, it always looks best. Hello, Tavern. Hello. How are you? We are coloring line art. Okay, that's 
good. I don't think there's anything down there. Ooh, yeah, I don't I don't think I ever changed my sound effects for alerts, but I am gonna um Lark is having an anniversary stream and I'm thinking about he's having an anniversary donathon. I'm thinking about uh, having a a donating enough to get him to do an alert sound. Because I like to torment Lark. It's, be it's because I love him. He's my son. Sort of. <laughs> I just, we, we all, look, we all love to bother Lark. It's, it's the thing that we do. It's, it's just how you do. Is it? Let me turn it up. I'll turn it up for you. There we go. Is that better? I don't know how to turn it up more. I could move it a little closer to myself, probably. It might be slightly too... Yeah, there we go. There we go. Uh, it was a little too far away from me. Move it, like, here? Is that better? Yeah, there we go. That seems to... Uh, that looks better on my monitor. God, I love round zero. Elements is good, but, man, round zero just hits different. Round zero just, round zero just fucking hits different, you know? Message Blackberry. Uh, so it's right ear, left ear, inner... So how are you doing, Tavern? How How is it? How are you? Should I be calling you, is it Sheena? Is it Sheena? You do. I'm like a fucking disaster with names. Sheila, Sheila. I'm gonna try and force that into my brain. I keep thinking Sheena because that's the character in Shinesman. I'm gonna try and force that into my brain. Cause I know people call me Sono even though that's not in my in my fucking name. I'm gonna get that in there, I swear. Uh... It's just I've been calling you Tavern for so long now. Oh, now my mic is in front of my layers palette. Can I put it, like, can I put it there? Is that gonna be, yeah, that, that looks fine. That looks fine on my monitor. Uh, on a break between tours. Nice. I hope, I hope you get a little rest. Rest is good. Rest is good. We don't want to work, overwork ourselves. Uh, so I think we're done with the ears. Uh, that's a little too, that's a little too green. Okay, so we do have to custom this one. Perfect. That's good, though. I, I am working really hard to keep myself from burning out. I'm working really hard to avoid burnout. Uh, I'm kind of, you know, taking breaks between, between projects, uh, left side, left side is this side. You just, you do what you can. It's, I, I have already, like, 
pushed myself to the absolute point of burnout. So, let me turn that back on. Turn it off for a second. So it's, you know, I'm trying not to do that to myself again. After next weekend, I'll be able to do that. Oof, yeah. Sometimes it do just be like that. Hello, Thunderbird. Hello. How are you? How are you? We are all vibing today. I'm glad everyone could be here, drop in, come to see me. Nice. We were just talking about how, how good breaks are. Left lower eyelid. Just talking about how good and important breaks are. How absolutely vital. <laughs> See my scenery. Emergency. Deca danger. Action. Perfect. Get on. Ready to go. King on a hot remark. Gonna get the yuku. God, I love Decker Ranger. I'm just thinking about Decker Ranger now. You ever just think about Decker Ranger? Do you ever just think about Decker Ranger? Like, ain't ain't that just the mood? Action. Perfect. Get on. Ready to go. King on a his sword. Ready to get. Gotta remember to lock my transparency. Mood. Think about Decker Ranger 100% of the time. Oh! Thank you. Thank you, Coyote. We will do that. I wanna get a- I wanna get a, um, a sound for that, too. Move the tongue. Just there we go. Just down one pixel is enough. Ever. He's here. 
ain't ready to go get money but the only gun I can say you could look look how cute this is with the mouth colored now like look how freaking cute Get the pajamas you Take a Okay, uh, so you need to turn off the ears for a second. I do just think about Decca Ranger like just constantly. Just all the time. Ooh. Hat back flat. There we go. Do both. It's no good. Hat bottom, bangs back, uh, where is head, where is the, oh, okay, face, so that's, that's what I want to turn off, and hair back. And nice and cut up, see you about the roller, decker, 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 ranger. just pop that up there easy to grab for later Deca Ranger darker yeah there we go definitely want this one up here because I'm gonna definitely gonna use that again uh, hat bow hat top bangs back and face uh, bangs back I don't actually think has any lines to it no But I do need to turn it off so that I can see the whole head. Face. Line. Face. Flat. We name our layers so that the, the rig artist does not have a problem. Uh, turn off the hat also. We are, we are nice. We, we, we work in cooperation with others, uh, so that they work in cooperation with us. this back on. You can turn the head off. <gasps> Maru! Maru, hello. Hello. You're in time for the Maji Ranger opening. 
We are coloring line art. What did I turn off? What did I turn off in here? There we go. We're coloring the line art so it's even cuter. Jacket bow, which means I'm going to need this. <laughs> yes, alongside Hibiki. Which I know, because Decker Ranger was alongside Blade. Uh, which I remember because I've seen set photos of the, the casts of both shows kind of fucking around together. All tokusatsu points towards Hibiki. It does. Which itself points towards Amazon. Which fills me with joy. Nice. Uh, uh, a lot of Hibiki conceptually, um, well, I know that, like there a lot of before Hibiki was a writer, there had been some pre-production done on it as another show. Um, but in making Hibiki a common writer, they took a lot of inspiration from Amazon and how like weird and different Amazon was. Uh, compared to other common writers of the era, and they wanted to do something just as kind of weird and different and, like, physical. Shit, it shouldn't be. I didn't hit done. Damn it. Um, but they wanted to do something as kind of physical and weird as Amazon. Uh, so they, in making Hibiki a writer, they drew a lot of inspiration from Amazon. Which I think is cool because I love Amazon. He's a good boy. Uh, I forget. This is like information that's been in my brain for 5,000 years. So I'm not sure exactly. Like I can't, I can't source myself very well. But uh, these are, these are just the, the facts I know about Amazon. <laughs> Because I just, I love Amazon. I just, I love that boy. He's a good boy. But I also, I love Hibiki. I... God, I think about fucking... I, Zanki and Todoroki fucked me up for a good while. That story that storyline fucked me up for a good long time. Uh, to the point that I went absolutely fucking nuts when that was such a such a part of the, the Hibiki arc in Zio. That, like, so much of that was about fucking Todoroki. Well, not so much of it was about Todoroki, but, like, a good... A good chunk of it. The part that I cared about because Waz fucking owns and was the fucking carrying that show. Yeah, no, I I do uh, wish that, but I think they just filmed the fucking uh, the Hibiki and Tenno pits at the same time. I'm assuming they just filmed those together. It did really, like, slam me in the face it it's one of the like hibiki blade hibiki and blade i think may have been the best tribute arcs in in zio um kabuto is okay kabuto is a pretty okay one agito is is pretty good um kiva fucking sucked kiva is the worst tribute arc in wizard is also very bad um, Ghost was good. Ghost was a pretty good one. Uh, but Wizard and Kiva were, like, the worst tributes that show did. And I'm, to this day, I am hurt. I live in, in constant suffering. Oh, yeah, the, the Another Rider suits, nine times out of ten were 
well, all of the designs were amazing. Some of them I just think were, like, less, uh, less good. Um, like, Kabuto, I feel like, I think I was, like, I found Kabuto to just be a little boring as far as another rider designs went. But it was still, like, good. It was still a good design, I just compared to the other ones. Like, compared to the other designs that show had done, I was like, really? You did, you couldn't have pushed this one a little... a little harder? Speaking of... Whoops! Didn't want to do that. Wanted to click that. I, I did love that they just fucking used another Agito. That was... I was kind of hoping that they would do that. I, but I wasn't convinced that they were going to. Because I'm like, I don't know. I don't know if they'll if they'll want to make that joke. And then they did, and I'm like, fuck Toei. It's one of the very few times you have not been a goddamn coward. Like, that was- that was such a good joke. Yeah... It's... But god, like... On the whole, they were all- like, another double- Another double from the movie is fucking in- That is an insane suit. I- like, I love another double. I love the fact that it has two complete faces. Like, facing forward, it's the double face. But if you're- if you're to one side of it, it'll either be the full Joker face or the full Cyclone face. And I'm like, it's this horrible Janus monster. This is disgusting and I love it. Uh, bottom lower left. It was just this- this horrible Janus beast. <laughs> it is a shame it only got to be in that movie and they didn't, uh, didn't have a proper double arc. But damn, that was a good suit. That was a good fucking monster. Just cause- just because double is inherently like fucking horrifying on its face but to to make it a monster to make a monster out of it was so fucking good Yes. Oh my god. The O's arc, the O's, like, tribute itself was, was good. I wish it wasn't about Dan Kuroto. I, I didn't mind the way they, like, kind of re, like, made AU, AG, and Hina. I thought that was interesting, and I like that, uh, Shu Watanabe, like, pinned the little red feather to his jacket for Ankh. Like, that was him. He decided that, apparently. Um, yeah, like, I love Dan Kuroto, but I'm like, this is this son, this ain't about you. This is about A.G. We're having an A.G. moment here. Let this boy have this. I just, I'm, I like Dan Kuroto, it was just, <laughs> sir, this is a Wendy's. Like, sir, <laughs> you can't just, you can't just do this. Which, I mean, you tell that to Dan Kuroto and it's only going to make him do it harder, but... It was just like, I don't- I don't need this to be about him. I have an emotional investment in O's already. Like, please just- Please just let me have- Please let me be sad about A.G. Go, 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 ready, go, Susanne, Bonkenja. 
Take me all, sort of all, Tony. Oops. God, I rewatched the fucking Bokenger episode of Go Kaiger recently. And it did just like. Just, it did just slam me right in the face. I was really surprised that it was not written by Naruhi Sarakawa. Because it. I always thought it was, because it damn fucking felt like it. Oops. Need to remember to transparency lock my layers. God, I love Bokenger. God, I just fucking love Bokenger so much. Like, yeah, I love Dan Kuroto, but I just, I didn't need that to be about him. Oh, that's right. I need to... I'll fix that later. Uh, turn off hips and legs. Uh, I, okay, I like the future Rider arc kind of more in theory than in practice. Uh, though, uh, Kamen Rider Kikai was great. That was, that was fucking genius. That arc... But a lot of my problem with that episode is that it implies that Sogo is capable of willing things into existence just because he wants to. Like, he unconsciously wills things into existence. And then they just never talk- there's another time it's implied, too, I forget exactly when. But then they just don't talk about it. At all. Ever. It's just never addressed. And I'm like, really? Because that's fucking interesting. It's a buck wild character trait. Uh, I actually never watched the last, like, five episodes. Uh, because I was really mad. One, I was really mad about the way they were characterizing Kamen Rider Aqua. Because that's my son. Um, he is my beautiful baby boy who I love very much. And I did, I was upset about that. So I already, like hadn't been watching them and then uh the week of the finale i went to tokyo and i just didn't watch it <laughs> uh i did watch the first episode yes i watched shinobi um but yeah i watched uh the first episode of zeo as it or the first episode of zero one as it aired uh but i didn't watch the zeo finale because i was still mad at it. Uh, oh no, the Shinobi episodes? No, I didn't watch those. 
um, because I just didn't care. I, I didn't care about Zio at that point. I was kind of emotionally done. I was kind of emotionally done after the White Waz situation. Like, as much as the Blade tribute itself was good, um, oh, the, yeah, the Kikai arc was fucking incredible. But after, like, the Blade, the Blade tribute itself was really good, but the White Waz, I already didn't like the White Waz situation, and then at the end of the Blade arc, they were like, okay, you know this, this thing that we've been building up and building up that, like, I, I didn't, I didn't quite like how it was being handled, but I thought it was making interesting implications. And then they're like, you know this thing that we've been building up for, like, three months? Yeah, okay, we're throwing it out. It never happened. We're never talking about it again. And at that point, I was, I emotionally checked out. I was like, okay, if you don't care, then neither do I. We're done here. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. Goodbye. Because that, that's my thing. Just, if, if they don't care then neither do I. Uh, torso. Okay, so this is gonna be a, excuse me, a little bit of a, of a thing because we're gonna color the whole line art green. Yeah, I do love me some Waz. Waz carried that fucking show. He really did. He really, truly carried the fuck out of that show. And then just everywhere that the lines cross into a white area, we just recolor them again. I, I, liked, I liked a lot of stuff about Zio in theory, and then Zio just kind of fucking fell apart. Like, they just didn't, they didn't know what they wanted to do with any of that show. Because I, I liked the, the idea of Sogo being this kind of morally gray, <laughs> like, potentially, because there were, early on, more so early on than once you hit maybe the halfway mark, if not the first quarter mark, there's a lot of very early shit Sogo does where it's heroic, but it's through this lens of... That that toy is mine, and you're not allowed to play with it. Um, like I think it was the was it the X Eight arc, where he he does something at the school, and he's like, no, everything here is mine, and I'm gonna protect it because it's mine. And I'm like, oh, you are a little bit of a fucking sociopath. Yeah, okay. I want to see how you grapple with, um, the like, how you perceive things. And then, after a while, that stopped being a plot thread. That stopped being a thing they did anything about, ever. And I was just like, oh, okay, never mind. So it's- I- I kept believing in Zio- oh, and then there was the part where they- where Tsukuyomi went back in time and pointed a gun at a bunch of eight-year-olds on a bus, and I was like, okay, now I'm really done. Um, that was the point at- like, I had already kind of emotionally checked out, but I think they something was going on that was kind of getting me back in. I think it was the the future riders arc because I thought that was interesting. And then Sukiyomi fucking points a gun at a bunch of eight year olds, and I'm like, okay, we're we're fucking done here. We're fucking done. I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> like I I stopped being willing to play their game. It was like, okay, y'all have decided that there aren't any rules, and I don't- I don't want to play this game anymore. Uh, I'm gonna 
turn the torso off, actually. Just so I can fully see these lines. It was just, it was such a weird moment where I'm like, Sukiyomi, you are literally the one in this show who knows how to use your words. Go on this bus and fucking talk. Please. Like, it just, it, it felt like such a misuse of her. Like, if it was Gates, if it was Gates, I'd completely fucking believe it. If it was Gates, I'd just been like, yeah, that's what he fucking does. Though I, I do kind of get upset when uh, characters are just fucking using guns. Though at least with her, it was the dumb phone gun. Like, early on in Zero One, I was really struggling with Jin as a character because man he sure just did have a real fucking gun that he shot people with sometimes um the voice actress episode the episode with the voice actress yuma gear where he just like fires into a crowd and i'm like mm, mm. and this was i think right after the um the the Ari i think it was ariana grande her the las vegas concert shooting it was, like, very shortly after that, I think, and I was like, mmm, mmm, don't, don't like this. Don't, don't like to see this. Do not, uh, do not want, do not want this. Uh, oh my god, the, the Gates with his fucking baby harness. Gates with, Gates with the, the fucking baby harness was so fucking funny. Um, like, it wasn't, like, the same week as the concert. It, the thing with, the thing with, uh, with Jin, it was just, it was within a couple months. And, uh, it just, it made me very uneasy. Uh, but yet, yeah, no, Gates wearing the fucking baby leash harness over the, the fours, the Amenagawa school uniform was the funniest fucking thing I've ever seen. Like, my, my favorite part of Gates was that he was wearing this baby leash harness, like, everywhere he went. I'm like, why? Why this? <laughs> Gates was a weird character, but I'm strangely fond of him. Like, I'm, I'm just strangely fond of his very weird feral energy. Oh, Sogo's uncle was amazing. He, he truly was the other MVP of that show. Okay, wh like I said, I was in, I was in Tokyo uh, when the finale was airing. And one of the first days I was there, like, it was the week of the finale. So one of the first days I was there... Uh, I went to, uh, Kamen Rider the Diner, because why would I fucking not do that? And they had a, a limited menu for the, like, a limited time menu for the finale. And I'm like, cool, I, I wanna, I wanna order off of that. And the thing that I ordered off of the limited time menu was, uh, Uncle's Apple Pie. And it was the best apple pie that I've ever eaten in my life. And I'm really upset that it was a limited menu item because it's not like I can even get it again if I go back there. It was the best apple pie I've ever eaten in my fucking life. I'm like, damn, no wonder Waz was willing to fucking betray Soko for this fucking pie. Like, it was, it was so fucking good. I'm like, I do not know why <laughs> this is so good, but it is. Uh, 
Uh, I also got the, I got the Deno fried rice. Uh, I had wanted to get, my, my original goal had been to get something from every era. Which I, I think I still, I got the Deno fried rice. I got the, oh I didn't, I don't think I got any Showa, anything Showa. Uh, because I had originally like planned a meal that I wanted to get. And then I got very, very motion sick on the plane. And, uh, the day of my reservation, I was still very sick. Like, I, I was still, I still really didn't feel good, so I was, I didn't eat the first couple days I was there, and I was still kind of feeling it. Um, so I, I got the Deno fried rice, the, I got a Kiva drink, um, and I got the Podichokin Forze french fries, because that was, that's been a meme since that was added to the menu. Like, that, that's been a meme for me for that long, so I'm like, I have to get those. And I, I ended up not getting any any of the Showa uh, dishes because I wasn't feeling well. And a lot of those are very, like, rich and heavy. So I'm like, I do not want to have this meal and then fucking throw up. Like, I would have been so upset if I ended up throwing up that meal. So I, I kind of changed my plan and didn't get something quite so heavy. Uh, they also, they give you a lot of freebies when you, uh, when you have a meal there. Um, if you order off a limited menu, there's like a random button set. Uh, so I have a, I have a Zio button, because that was the one that I ended up getting. Um... They give you a little cup with a sugar cookie that's on a little uh, saucer, and the saucer has a logo for a rider on it, and then the sugar cookie has, like, a, a rider printed on it, so that- the cookie was Forze, and the little saucer, I think, is X? Might be X. I forget exactly. Uh, cause I- it, it looks- the logo looks like it should be for V3, but it's not. Uh, and then when you leave, they hold up, like, three coasters, like, three little, little, like, paper coasters with the back facing you, and you pick one, and those also have a rider on it, and I got Ryuki from that. So, they give you a lot of little freebies, and then I bought a, a rubber coaster of Kiva. It's a little, like, silhouette of Kiva. Uh, and I use that every day. I've used that rubber coast that Kiva coaster every day since I came back. That was a good trip. I want to go back eventually. <laughs> Michi voice, I will betray anything and anyone for that apple pie. I want to fight Michi with my bare hands. Was I talking about that yesterday on Twitter? The other day on Twitter? How I want to fight that boy with my bare hands. Because I'm still very upset about him as a character that exists. I really- I was really hoping that I would like him because his suit uh, reminded me of Melee. And I wanted, um, because I had a, a little, a very funny little display that was, re it was the, um, Jungle Fury? Is Jungle For Fury the Power Rangers that aligns with Geki Ranger? Um, I think it's Jungle Fury. Um, so I have the Rio and Melee toys from that, from that season of Power Rangers. I don't know what they're called in that season of Power Rangers. But I have them. And then I have uh, my Figuarts uh, Kamen Rider Beast. Figuarts... Ah, uh, shit, what is it? Uh, Figuarts Gosei Knight. And uh, several other... Yes, it is Camille. I, I remember that. I haven't actually watched Jungle Fury. I've just looked up Melee so many fucking times. Um, 
and then various Robo Knight toys from uh, Megaforce because I, f I just fucking love Gosei Knight so much. And I put them all together because they were all like black lion themed. Like bla these black and gold lions. And I didn't have, and like the joke was that Rio and Melee were their parents. Um, and I'm like, oh, but May we need one one kid for Melee, one kid that looks like Melee, and then Gaim came out and, and, uh, I don't fucking remember what his rider name is, but Michi's suit looked like, it, it was the same, like, color palette as Melee's, and it was dragon-themed, and she's a lizard. She's a, she's a chameleon. That's the fucking joke. Melee. Cub, melee and, um... And then it turned out I fucking hated him. <laughs> and I was like, no. I never bought the figure art, but I was like, damn, I was so close to, like, buying that on site. Thank God I didn't, because I fucking hate him. Does it? I don't, I don't, I should know more Italian, but I don't, uh, because I'm shameful. That is very funny, though. Actually, when I was learning Spanish in high school, um, this is the only, the only, like, scrap of Spanish I remember. I always remembered manga meant sleeve, just because it was the word manga, which I'm definitely not pronouncing properly for saying it in Spanish, but I was always like, that's, like, la language is fascinating, that it means comic in one language and sleeve in another. So it was just a word that I had a very easy time remembering because of that. Mango. Mango. I don't know. I, I don't know where I'm going with this. It's just, language is, language is truly fascinating. <laughs> then sometimes you forget how to say something in three languages and feel an existential level of shame. To be fair, I am barely bilingual. I am just barely bilingual. Um, my, my Japanese is fucking abysmal, is what it is. Um, but half the time I, there will be things that I can, like, figure out how to say better in Japanese, and then realize that this is a language no one around me speaks. Uh, a lot of regional differences. I'm not used to talking to people younger than my parents. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I found out yesterday that a a friend there's a okay, this is this is gonna be kinda weird. I watch a lot of stuff on like internet horror and uh like ARGs and shit like that. I also watch a lot of stuff on lost media. So I, you know, a thing that's going on in both circles is trying to find the origin of the Jeff the Killer image, if y'all know about that. So yesterday, a friend of mine DMs me and is like, hey, I, I like need to talk to you about something. Uh, like, I'm, I'm kind of, like, freaking out a little bit. And he tells me that, like, this, the group, the, someone from the Discord server of that hunt DM'd him about, like, an image in his old photo bucket account that was the image that it was photoshopped from. 
and he's possibly one of the earliest people in the in outside of one of the earliest people outside of Japan to post that image to the internet because he found it on an old like image an old like Japanese image board way way back in the day and he was like how did you fucking find all of like all of my old shit and like it was it was cool but it's a little weird because you know all that shit is out there But it's just like, oh. <laughs> like, because they, they have found the image itself that it was photoshopped from, but they don't know where that image came from. Like, that's where the hunt is at right now, apparently. And then, like, he remembered there had been a couple more, and he was like, oh, but they, it was a couple computers ago, I, like, I don't have access to it anymore. And then he remembered me that he does know where the hard drive for that computer is. Uh, his friend encased it in silicone and made a trophy out of it. So we're like, oops. <laughs> but it, it's all potentially out there somewhere. Here we go. I, God. I fucking. Goanger is such a, a mystery and a miracle. It's so buck wild and strange. I love it dearly with all of my heart, but holy shit, what a- what a strange show. Like, what a- what a creature. What a gremlin of a show. Like, there- there is no explaining go on It just- it just is. It's just like this. You just have to come in to go on your ready to deal with that. I can, honestly, I can't believe we got a ten year anniversary movie for go on your. Like what a what a weird fucking thing to get an anniversary movie for. Oh, uh, where is my torso? There we go. Look at that. Look how good that looks with the the colored line art. Let me grab the skin outline. Uh, 
Okay, let's see. Let's get our legs turned back on. Are we, is it just the hair and the hat? Okay, I think it's just the hair and the hat. <laughs> Choo Choo, what do your special eyes see? Uh, turn off the head. Turn off the neck. Or so. And there we go. Lines are all colored. Decade does have this really wild opening. I don't know if it's one of my favorites, but it is one that like always stands out to me. And I think it's just, you know, it's gacked. So it's got that very gacked flair. There we go, look! Look how, how friggin' cute! Look how friggin' cute. Okay, Captain, you take care. You have a good one. <laughs> I mean, reasonable. I just saved! I just saved Coyote! Look, it's, it's dark! Um, turn the jacket back on. Here, turn the jacket back on and then I can save. <laughs> who threw that? I know who threw that. Okay. Uh. Oh no, they were little. Uh, they were little floppy disks. Uh, I think I. I think I retweeted them. Recently, someone did them. Someone did them. I know. I. I have it saved. Uh, they work for both Kbonk, which is what I use, and Tits. Uh, you can use it for either. Oh, nice. Okay, you were the you were the one that retweeted it. <laughs> yeah, they move kind of fast. What layer does it even think I'm on? Not that. Normal color brown? Hmm. Da, 
Chambada, chambada. <laughs> yes, uh, I had an easier time with K-Bonk than with Tits. Um, tits was really hard for me to set up, and I couldn't quite get it to calibrate right. Um, I was having a lot of trouble with it. Uh, K-Bonk is a little, has a little bit steeper of a learning curve, but I had a much easier time, uh, figuring it out. It connects to things a little more directly. I also couldn't get Tits to ever connect to, uh, VTube Studio. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Maru. You have a you have a good taking care of whatever you need to take care of. It's drinking the oh. water. Oh. Oh, there I go. Thank you. Okay, there we go. Are we back? Uh, I don't know what just happened. I have no idea what just happened. I don't, I don't, I do not know what just occurred. Oh my goodness. Uh, I just got, uh, oh shit. Y'all can't hear anything. You can't hear, can't hear the music? 